Uh, my name is Gary Conley and I work with the uh, Buena Ridge School at Ohio University in Athens, Ohio and I am the Ecological and Environmental Research Supervisor. I oversee and develop environmental and ecological projects to mostly do restoration and uh, reclamation projects to improve the ecosystem services and the, the environments that we have here in Southeast Ohio. My, uh, my first field guide was a, was a Golden Guide tree identification book that uh, my uncle had given me when I was about 10 years old. And it just turned me on to exploring the environment and realizing the diversity of, one, trees that we have, and then upon realizing the diversity of trees, the diversity of plants, the diversity of wildlife, and through, through that continuous study and interest in our natural world, uh, gained a great understanding of the complexity of our ecosystems here in southern Ohio. And I'm interested in how our ecosystems respond to disturbance and pollutants and how we can best to overcome uh, some of the, the barriers that prevent our natural systems from reaching their full potential of delivering ec ecological services. It's very important for us to keep monitoring uh, because the systems are changing constantly. Um, first of all, we have uh, what, I, what I like to describe as a legacy with the ecosystem. We're dealing with uh, events and conditions that have happened o over the last decades, hundreds of years, thousands of years. Those legacies are still imprinted on the landscape now and our ecosystems are still recovering from those changes and we have our own changes going on as we speak. This is a great place to study how those ecosystems uh, change and adapt over time and in the face of global warming and climate change. Um, I think it's really important for us to, to note even the subtle changes so that we can begin to plan into the future how best to manage our ecosystems so that we continue to support the ecosystem services that we're so dependent upon. I really enjoy watching those changes that happen in nature over time. Um, nature always impresses me with her resilience and her ability to overcome these disturbances and to adapt to changes. So I know that the right answers are out there for us to find and we all got to keep exploring for those. Math and science, of course, you know, our, our STEM uh, curriculum is, is very important for us to engage in. Um, even if you, you don't get one of those, S, T, or E, or M, um, then you can find your part to, to fill uh, in, in that whole effort. Um, our future depends on it, and I'm quite certain of that.